everyone on YouTube, you know who it is, it's your boy DJ Cool Thing. Welcome back to another video on my channel and welcome to another service review. And let's roll that intro. Okay, YouTube, let's get into the subject of today's video. Today's video is all about Adobe Spark, as you see here on the desktop of the mid-2012 13-inch MacBook Pro. So, this is what I use to create my YouTube thumbnails. And just to give you an example, I've created a YouTube thumbnail for this particular video that we're recording right now. So what I did was I took the Adobe Spark logo and I um, scaled it all the way down so you can see the entire logo in full detail. I added the text by double tapping it and I just typed in the word Adobe Spark. And I went down here and I typed in the word review and I pressed done and I would move the text around to get it to look nice and clean and presentable when it's on my YouTube video so you can add different stuff like text photos different icons a logo you can add a logo um, add your own logo to any project and unleash your brand's potential that is neat different filters you can add different filters I decided to leave it at the regular filter the non none filter to keep it as original as possible. Uh, image, you can flip, you can move freely, you can uh, remove background, you can replace, you can rotate, you can scale, and you can add different um, elements like text, photos, icons, and your own logo, and, and really help promote your brand, which is what I might do in the future when I upgrade to Adobe Spark. Uh, for individuals, which is $9.99 a month. The teams are $19.99 a month, so it's a great price to get started making YouTube thumbnails and intro videos and Instagram posts and Facebook posts and Facebook covers and Twitter posts and Twitter covers. The possibilities are endless. And when you download it, you can save it as a PNG, a JPEG, or PDF, which is in, still in beta. So you can save it as a PNG, Better for graphics, higher quality, better for photos, smaller file size, um, PDF, better, best for processing, highest quality, and so much more. I just think that's really cool. And right here is the replace button. Here's the delete button. You can customize it to your liking. So to get started with making a logo for um, a, a YouTube thumbnail, is you go to YouTube thumbnail and you would create any from these um, pre-made templates you can customize it to your liking let's say I want this one this will be great for like uh, a wedding it's got that it's got that amazing text you can edit the template if you want to edit the template and it will load up get the uh, template ready you, can, you know delete the um, picture and change up the wording a little bit to create you know to really I just think that's really cool we're gonna delete it because we're not gonna be making another YouTube thumbnail because we already made one right here so you can discover the latest there's my recent projects there's start with a beautiful template and of course, different uh, pre-made templates for all different types of um, graphics and web pages and videos. So I, I would highly recommend uh, Adobe Spark if you're just getting into making uh, custom thumbnails and Instagram posts and Facebook posts and Facebook covers and Twitter posts, Twitter covers, you name it. If you're just getting started with graphics and stuff, you can, I would highly recommend Adobe Spark. 
So with social, there's Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter. It's all in Adobe Spark. You can even create an Instagram story to help promote a certain you know thing when it comes to DJing. You can create an Instagram story if you want to make an Instagram story. You can make brochures. You can make uh, business cards to help promote your business. So it's got a lot of business templates in here to create, you know, to help promote your business and Instagram posts. Uh, yeah, Instagram posts, Facebook cover, Facebook posts, YouTube thumbnails, which is what I use the most for my YouTube channel. Twitter posts, which I need to start using more often for my Twitter account, which is uh, twitter.com forward slash DJ cool thing or cool thing entertainment. One of those two. You can create a, a Twitter post, a Facebook ad, a newsletter, a flyer. I mean, the possibilities are endless. And I actually might start using Adobe Spark for my new intro video for uh, YouTube. So, you know, have a much fresh uh, intro for all of my videos. I'm actually going to start doing that, you know, this week for my next video, which is an unboxing video. So, yeah, there's the Projects tab, which will take you to all your projects, your brand, your libraries, your Learn, which is Discover the Latest, and learning all about Adobe Spark if you don't know how to use it. and. As you can tell, it's very easy to use, it's very simplistic, and it's got a lot of amazing templates to work around of what you actually want to make. So, with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up. Make sure you leave a positive comment down in the comment section down below. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell, so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. The next time, your boy DJ Cool Thing, Cool Thing Entertainment, out. Peace.